Hey Lemlisters! I hope you're having an amazing week and that you're ready for some personalization fun. I'm ready! If you want to know the secret to achieving a 90% open rate and a 40% reply rate, continue watching. Hey everyone, this is Charlotte, Digital Marketing Manager here at Lemlist, the tool that lets you create personalized outreach campaigns, build relationships with your prospects and get more replies in the process. All right, who of you has received this kind of salesy email? If any of you haven't, please tell me your secret. <laughs> Hi, first name, look at us, how cool we are. We did this and that, and honestly, I don't know how you could live your life without us. So what are you waiting for? Buy your product, I'll even give you a little discount because I'm so nice. Um, yeah. <laughs> and who of you has received this kind of email? Hey Charlotte, I really enjoy watching your YouTube videos. Oh, why, thanks. <laughs> Especially, <laughs> Okay, I'm gonna start again. Especially the one about personalized videos. I totally agree that in order to create successful outreach campaigns, you need to take personalization a step further. I would love to connect and exchange some ideas about this. Would you be free for a quick chat over a cup of coffee? It's on me. Let me know, Guillaume. Which one would you go for? The first one? <laughs> me too. Just kidding. Duh. Apart from Guillaume's email being extremely relevant in terms of the message he's sending, which is, as we all know, key, it is almost irresistible because of the custom image that he included in his email. It's not only super relevant to his message, but also highly creative and gives a name to the person behind the email. It literally adds the cherry on top of the cake. Now, this image template is one of the most successful ones and it has been coined by one of our very first Lamlisters, Cam. So thank you, Cam, for sharing it with the whole entire community. Another example is the one right here where you have a screenshot of your prospect's company website and the face of your prospect. This is amazing because it adds so much authenticity to your email. Now, let's get down to business. How do you integrate one of those awesome other fudgers in Lamlist? <laughs> Sorry about that. I shouldn't say this kind of thing. Apparently, I don't have swag, at least according to my roommate. Who you are. So, how do you integrate one of those amazing pictures in your beautiful campaign sequence? Now, for the coffee template, all you need to do is to take a picture of you holding two blank coffee cups and save it somewhere. What you want to do then is to create a sequence on Lemlist and click on the image template button in the sequence creator, which is right here. And then you choose create a blank image. You will then be taken to the edit image step where you can add an element and there you want to choose image like this. And all you need to do is to upload the picture that you took before. You can also add a link in case that you saved your image somewhere on the internet. And there you go. Now you have your image and now you can just add text elements in order to insert the variable first name like this. You can just drag it, position it the way you want it to like that. Type first name. Don't forget to use the right brackets because otherwise Lemlist won't be able to recognize it as a variable and you really want that to happen because otherwise you'll just have first name on your cup instead of the actual first name of the person. Then, of course, you want to add your name as well. For this example, I'm going to choose Guillaume's name because it's him in the picture. And then also choosing the handwriting because that just makes it way more authentic like this. And then I can just click on save and there you go. So basically for your campaign, the first name variable here will be replaced with the first name of each of your prospects. Now you just click on back and here you can see that your custom image has been inserted into your sequence. If you go on your review step, you can check that each lead is receiving the right name on their coffee cup. If you want to create a custom image containing a screenshot of the prospect's company's websites, company logo and profile picture, for example, this is how it's done. Now, in your CSV file that contains your leads, you want to make sure that in addition to the classic variables such as first name and email, it also contains the variable picture. Then you want to take a picture of yourself, like this one of Elia, for example, and upload it the same way as we just did for the coffee cup photo. Now, you choose the elements you want to add. For the website screenshot, you choose website and email domain which basically means that Lamlist will choose the domain of your email address to find the prospect's website and then insert the screenshot dynamically into each email. The same goes for the company logo, which is why I won't go into adding that element into more detail right now. 
Now, all that you want to do for the website is you chose website with email domain, and then you can basically just adjust the image to the size of the website screen on your photo like this. Then you can add your photo element like this and also position it the way you want it to appear in your email. So in order to make sure that the photo is going to be appearing the right way in your final email, so personalized for each lead, you simply need a link to your prospect's profile picture in the column picture of your CSV file. You can either automate this by importing your leads via LinkedIn, including their profile picture, or you can also add their pictures manually in the CSV file. And again, as per the usual, you can check that your leads photos are inserted correctly by simply going on the review step. And here you can see that our website screenshot and the profile pictures are working out well for each and every one of our leads. And there you go. That's all there is to it. Now, I only showed you two possibilities of custom images to add to your email, but the options are literally endless. Don't hesitate to be creative and use out-of-the-box images, such as pets or other scenarios that work for the context of your email. All you need to keep in mind is that it needs to be relevant to your prospect and adapted to their profile. I hope this video helped you. If you want to stay up to date with news on sales automation and Lemlist, make sure to subscribe to our channel as we upload new videos every week. If you have any feedback or questions, we would love to hear about it in the comments. In the meantime, stay amazing and I'll see you in the next video.